Um, do you have that little sheet thing? Yeah. Does anybody want to uh, speak at uh, public input too? Okay. No, no, not the cheats. I, I'm. What do I? The little spiel I got there. Oh yes, you know I do. The, you know I know. Yes, oh, you know the oh, spiel. Oh yes, I'm sorry. Yes. Oh, I don't have yeah, my channel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Oh, okay. I thought you were saying. <laughs> Elena Loretto. Um, I'm, I'm very happy that you brought up that piece about. Actually, actually, it was Jennifer who brought it up that uh, we should have some kind of a uh, long-range plan update every five years. I was looking at the website, in fact, today. The last time it was done for us, it was uh, actually started in 2007 and revised in 2008. So we're just seven years behind, not five. But uh, you know, I encourage you to continue with your plan with BBS. Um, and that brings me to the questions that you had uh, a few other questions about things you raised tonight. The survey, will it be all hard copies or both hard copies, electronics? It's, it's uh, completely electronic. You can, you'll be able to print it out, but it will be, you'll, go to, you'll go to the website and it'll be on the website. I still have to build it, but it will have all the costs. It will have everything that, like you would for a bond project or anything like that. Everything will be completely transparent. It's going to take me a little while to get it all put together so everybody Fine. can get to it, you know? I'm just thinking of fraud. Will it be a way of controlling how many people respond? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. So they, they think, yes, they believe that, and she's double checking for me, but that it, it will be only um, uh, one, one IP, IPO address, is it called? Scott, you have to help me. What that What is that called? Your IP, IP address? Your IP address, right. that they yeah. can control for IP address. Okay. What if there's a couple? In the household using the same computer. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but it's. I'll. I'll ask that question. Can okay. I ask a question? No, I'm sorry. What happens if it's somebody honestly, honestly does not have access? Will we take a handwritten copy? I'm assuming yes, right? Uh, we could give them access here at the school. That's true. I think. That's true. Well, I mean, I know yeah. some seniors who wouldn't know where to touch a computer to start. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. I would. I will. We'll do it just yeah. like we do for the. You don't want to transport them. We'll to do the just so like can. we do for the bond yeah. project, where we can make them available, like at the library, with like the hand, like a, 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 paper, a, copy. a, paper, a paper copy. Paper copy. That's a good point. So we'll. Yeah, I'll talk to them about because um, when we do the um, when we do the bond project, we have to make it available in the main office and at the library and at like you know like two other places, so we can have those available, you know. But we just have to be careful that we have like some kind of identification or something like that. Absolutely. Again, I'm thinking Freud. Yeah. yeah. I'm sorry, I think this weird way, but I don't That's trust That's a good people. point. Sorry. Um, <clears throat> has the facilities committee <coughs> been, <coughs> Bless you. Thank you. been uh, consulted on what uh, BBS is about to do? Have they been consulted at all? About? You know, you had mentioned that you just received this report. Just a few days ago? No, we really feel like we got to talk to the community. We feel like we got to. Rather than your committee, yeah, who has no. been involved with this sort of thing. Right. You know, James Sanford was here a couple of meetings ago saying, well, he hasn't heard a thing. You know, I mean. Well, we've only had we've only had one um, we've only had one facilities me meeting, but the community is going to get every every bit of information. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And uh, you mentioned something about workshops. What's the time frame on that? When? Well, it, it's going to, for me to put this together, it's going to be a, a little bit labor intensive because it's, it's a deep, it's a deep amount of information. Mm -hmm. And the board can only do this when they all come together. They can't do it, can't have ex parte conversations. They have to do it when they're, when they're a group and they're together. Um, so now they've kind of charged me with putting this together this month and then having the survey available in January. Then they will look. They'll have the survey results, and that's what they'll do with the workshop: is the survey results. So, you know, I would think that would be at the end of January. I just don't know how long it takes to. to I've never done that before, so I'm learning. I, this has never been in my wheelhouse. So, I mean, I, you know, I'm. I'm that's good. Yeah. That's good. That's great. Yeah. But we really the most learning, the, the most important thing is you know, and and this was from from our communications um, folks have said that to let your community look at everything 
all at the same time and let them weigh in and have an opinion. And I think that's really important. I'll take, I, I'll take that from them. Okay, so you're sending out the information. People will respond to the survey, and what's the next step? And then we, we compile that information, uh, much like you did when you hired me as a superintendent. Everybody put their information in, and then we had it all back so everybody could see what everyone was thinking. And then that would be the workshops? Yes, yeah. So like, area. and one of them could be, don't purchase this. So we, we'll see that weight, and we'll see the weight on, you know, choices X, Y, Z, yeah. Yeah, or E, like folks may have some, some real strong opinions of their own about how that facility should be used or not used. Okay, so what is your outside time frame? Are we thinking about the May election, if there's a bond? It, it'll have to be May or June, because my time frame is, is, so, is pushed so far out. It will have to be May or June, right? I can't do it sooner than that. Okay. Rumor <coughs> had it, it was February. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's no. <laughs> that's not true. <laughs> okay. All right. Thank and you. And I think much. that's better for our community too because they'll all be here, you know. Fine. Fine. Um and before I forget, uh the Noyak Civic Council again has extended okay. the invitation yeah. to invite you folks March 8th. It's a Tuesday, 7:30 in the evening. Please mark your calendar. You can come and pitch it right there. Okay. Live without a camera. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Does anybody else um, want to speak at public input too? Okay. Does the board have any any old business or any items for discussion? Okay. Again, thank you. Thank you. Questions and oh, stuff. Great. That's great. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Okay. So then I want a motion to adjourn the meeting. So moved. Second. Okay.